What is up y'all? Welcome back to another freaking video. Welcome back to Black Bastard TV. <laughs> <laughs> this makes episode five. Yes. And if y'all haven't checked out the last episode, go check it out. Um, we talked about nine to fives and you know, like multiple incomes and stuff. So today y'all, we will be talking about Louisville Hair Stylist. Hmm. Right. <laughs> If you know, you know. Okay, if you don't, I don't know. <laughs> Get your hair done. No. But um, so let me start off by saying no judgment here, strictly opinions <laughs> or facts, you know, it is what it is. But this is Black Master TV. We lay it out, we spray it up, and we let it go. That's what it is. So let's hop right into it. Um, damn, I almost forgot to introduce you. She forgot me. <laughs> well, you can introduce yourself. Today we got hey. Paris is in the building, y'all. <laughs> Long time friend, you know. What I want to know is, um, has it ever been a time that it was hard to get in touch with a little hairstylist? Yeah. I got ghosted. Like, girl, she was like doing my trims and stuff, mm -hmm. deep conditioning. She just, she did these one little body stuff. She just had real small knotless and white pull out my hair. Uh, I text her, I told her, she said, it ain't nothing happened before, it might be the bees. I said, mm, I don't know how to do it. Uh-uh. Then I gotta make another appointment for some, what's on? Uh, Butterfly walks. Oh, uh, yeah. Girl, she didn't text her, she kept on. I'm booked, I'm booked, I'm booked. I was like, okay. Yeah, she must not have wanted the money. No. At it that point. Like yes. It do, in Louisville, okay? Um, my experience, I just know when I make an appointment, they don't be like responding. So I'm like, do I have an appointment or do I not? But the one, this girl that I do get my hair done from, she's, you know, pretty, you know, she communicates. But in the past, it was really hard. And I'm seeing multiple people get their hair done. And I'm like, damn, she skipped me. Yeah, you don't do my hair. Yeah, do my hair. <laughs> I fucking did. Now, how do you feel though, like, when you do get your hair done and they don't post? your uh hairstyle i don't really care like it depends on like if you sitting there okay do this pose okay do that pose mm -hmm. like you're doing the utmost to get out of the footage and stuff right. and then i get on instagram later i'm not seeing them i get on next week i'm seeing everybody else getting posts i'm like so right where y'all at where right. my pose <laughs> i only feel that way like my lash artist so she'll take her time like she'll pause in the middle or something and like, you know, I'm thinking she's getting a video or something, but I don't ever see it on the page. Right. So I'm like, maybe she takes it. Like, like what is doing? Little one, two, before <laughs> and after. I don't know what she be doing. Uh, but I just be hoping it be looking all right. Like her and lashes. Girl, one of my <laughs> last videos, you can see my lips and they was so dry. I am dead. Uh, like, it'd be uh, like that. No. <laughs> no, I need somebody to let me know like, we're gonna put some gloss on. Right. <laughs> now, when they take the tape off, that's girl. I be looking like <laughs> thin, white all under the eyes. And then you look tired. Tired oh. as hell. Pores done pop down. And you got my no. hey boo tapes. I hate boo. My hate boo. Can we reschedule for this? Yes. Day? Hey boo. I'm yes. <laughs> but you know what I personally don't like about the reschedules? But they don't be taking money off, and it be their fault. Can I'm sorry. Back? Something. <laughs> I'm like, damn, she done rescheduled me. Say I want to come Friday at four. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, I can't do this. Now. Okay. Well, by the time the next week comes, some of them's probably gonna fall off. As far as last year, yeah. so it's kind of like, okay, now it's not a feeling. I might need to have to be a new set. Yeah. You know how I like the little crackhead lashes. I'm right. Like, one looks too left. Real talk. I got some shit hanging right now. <laughs> I was like, I had to take a break. <laughs> But I'm saying, like, I'm like, damn. So, or say if they late, right? It's they fault, right? Yeah. Not that it's a problem, but it's like you late. Nah. Shouldn't you take like twenty hours off? I had that. They don't be doing that no more. They used to. They used to be like, oh, it's okay. You know, I'm running my Um, I'll just take ten hours off your appointment. The they don't do it. Yeah. That's what it was. The new ones, they yeah, like in high school, it was like I guess I don't know more respect or something. It's my girl. School with her, she got her shot. She was dumb, like, 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 girl. like dumb late, 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 like, late to the appointment, like, it was like 30 or 45 minutes. I'm just sitting in the parking lot, 
cook us some food or something. Right. Like, we're down the street. They didn't let day. you know? No, she was like, I'm on the way. I'm on the way. I found some on the way. Oh, man. Wait. Is he loose? He is. What the fuck? Girl. Girl. Yeah. I'm trying to see what these guns do. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Yeah, on top of my hood. Uh, oh, he made it. He's still in the water. Yeah. We're probably thirsty. Now, though, what was you saying? Um, oh, girl, it's late. She kept on saying, I'm on the way. I'm on the way. I said, oh, okay. And then, like, I'm going to say, I was like, you can just reset. She's like, no, I found someone to write. And then she pulled up. She was getting like, really with her appointment. She was just. As if it was your fault. I was trying to just get a chair on the step. And then I'm like, like, she's like, do you want me to flat on your hair anyway? I was like, I guess that's fine. I was trying to stay with the heat, but that's fine. Right. And then, girl, I came out looking like James Bond. Oh, my God. <laughs> and I bet she hyped it up the whole time. It's still cute, you know. Let me just. <laughs> Bump it. Let me do a little flip no, right here. No, we used to do it's the bump in middle school. I told my mom that's that. Oh my god, I used to hate bumping. I used to be like, Mama, stop. Like, make it straight. Don't, don't touch my hair. Just leave it alone. No, girl, I had um the stylist I had went to. I think this girl from high school, we ain't gonna say her names, I guess. But no, she had put me on to her because she used to do her whole family. So I was like, oh shit, give me her number. And ever since then, I was going to her till about 2019, 2020. Cause I had got a little broke at that time, <laughs> but I had hit her back up and girl, I done washed. I done blow dried. I, first off, I done took my hair down. I done washed. I done blow dried. I'm ready. Oiled up. Not too much though, just but just, just a little oil for the scalp. <laughs> girl, why am I texting her? She don't reply. And she's supposed to come to my house. She was doing house uh, appointments. Yeah, girl. Girl, girl, and this happened three times with her. But I had to understand the situation at the time something was going on with her son, but she uh, wouldn't let me know I that. Was say, you yeah, communication. Right, that's what I'm saying. I didn't know that at the time. Till like I, uh, two months later and she was like, I'm sorry she explained everything. But it happened three times before like, the explanation. Right. Then blow dried and everything. I was pissed. Mm -hmm. I kept giving her the benefit of the doubt. It's how I and I'm like, okay. You know, girl. Then I'm excited about the styles and my phone. <laughs> I'm ready to go. <laughs> She's like not answering or nothing. <laughs> then she'll move it. Say it's like what? 7 a.m. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do nine. Like move it every two hours. And we don't want to do nothing. Right. Mm -hmm. Cause I'm up already. I'm ready. You know. Mm -hmm. It be like at the mobile. In my birthday. Just now for this hairstyle. I think we rescheduled like three or four times. Like it, half of okay. it was my fault. The other half was her fault. The first time, she got like a miscommunication when she thought I was canceling the appointment. So like I was just sitting at the shop, like oh, just you waiting on. Waiting. I was like, you know your work? She was like, I didn't know you was coming in today. I was like, no, uh, no, don't say that. Yeah. Don't say that. Then my next one was Ooh. I got a new number. And she, I forgot to send it to her. Mm -hmm. So that was my fault. So she texted me and she overbooked. And she was trying to cash out me the money back. So then I come all the way to the shop, her blow dry, mm -hmm. my braiding her on the side. Right. You know, <laughs> I done ran to like three different stores for blonde. I was just like, she's like, I'm so sorry. You can reschedule. Then the third one, she booked it at like eight. You know, I work at UPS. So I get off dumb late. Right. I didn't sat there. I waited. Fell asleep in the bed on car. <laughs> Oh my god. It still missed the appointment. It still missed it. Oh my god. Yeah, I finally got it. Period. The luck to get your hair done. Y'all comment if y'all ever had an experience <laughs> as far as, you know, having to be rescheduled or, you know, anything pertaining to an appointment, not being on time. <laughs> what about the appointments? Uh, when you book the appointment, but uh -huh. you're still waiting. Right. You ain't getting your hair done until like an hour later. Yeah, because somebody's in the church. And then they be like, well, you supposed to set your hair day It's like, no. No. If I book 12 o'clock, I need 12 o'clock. No, that's funny, though, because uh, my braider just said, she said, girl, I done used up your whole side. <laughs> I'm like, girl, I ain't had nothing to do. Like, I hate that. But no, no, I only hate it, though, when I'm texting my friends, like, yeah, girl, I'm going to be done by 6 and we can still go. We're going to get lunch. Plans is done. <laughs> Plans are done. I done moved it now. She's still working on it. 
Auntie done called. No, <laughs> we ain't done. My mama, she <laughs> said, you still that? Yeah. Yeah. I made dinner. Oh, damn. damn. That sound nice. <laughs> Sun done set. Hello, this pitch black dark. I swear it was like eight o'clock when I got in here. Um, yeah, I said I should have brought uh, some card games and a drink. You know, I brought a little snack or something, yeah. pack me a little backache. Hey, if I knew I was gonna be here that long. <laughs> but hey, some of them styles be worth it though. Like when you there, it's like, okay. And, you know, I'm feeling myself. Right, like, when you, you get up, it's like, okay. But still. Right. <laughs> like, where was your ass? Communication need to be key. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. No more hey boos. <laughs> you know how many hey boos and can you had over one? I was like, hold on. Oh, like, oh my god, I'm supposed to be with someone. I have to get that hair at home. How oh. to drive? And she's on the move. So you have to drive back. I hope 30 minutes. Drop 30 minutes back. She said, well, if you stop and get Starbucks, I will charge you. Charge you for your way. I was like, okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what oh, you want? You need something else? I am crying. Sure. I ain't never, um, I, that's the one thing I ain't did is like, uh, bought a meal or something. I'm like, uh, here you go. In place for something. It depends. I depend. Like, if I feel like it's fair, you yeah. know, I'd be like, um, you like five minutes, like, you need to do this. No. Yeah. Can't sit up on your I feel like as long as we keep it updated, like, hey, you know, like you told me, I'm the hand, but I'm coming. Right. <laughs> like, that's straight. I be running behind, though. I be, I don't know. I be moving slow. It's, it's okay, girl. <laughs> hey, these styles, though. I think it's because we see them as, like, professionals or business people or whatever. I feel like it depends. Like, they get comfortable sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Some get real comfortable and treat you like they cousin. I'm like, no. So yeah, so I don't get too comfortable with our everybody. Mm -hmm. Cause you know, certain people get do certain style. Well, for me, like I'll go to this person for a braid on the scalp, and then go to this person for. I was about to ask. I was like, about to say yeah. chair hop. <laughs> yeah, in a way for certain styles. That's how I, mean, like, I got a girl for my sewing, my girl for my knockers. See, girl for this. You got to, cause not everybody's good at their craft, and they will lie to your face. But I can do it. I can come yeah. out. You sit in the car. Right. On Snapchat current. <laughs> I'm fucking dead. Or you'll see one of their uh, other photos. It's like, damn, she did good on this. But, mm. like, what was, Girl, what was going what, on her? What happened with, what happened with me, my right. What happened with me? What you just say? That's it. But, yeah, I do look at them as, like, you know, like, y'all supposed to have y'all shit in order. Y'all business people. But then again, they are, like, local. Either our age or, like, that's what, I think that's what a little is, older. I be trying to treat them like my auntie, like, she got a shop on Jefferson, and like she be on her stuff. She got like an online booking thing. I was in, like, while she doing one here, one here is on the dryer, one here about to get really? washed. Like she, yeah. So I be thinking, okay, everybody gonna be like that, and then it be like, no. It's like people don't be having nothing to do with no that. I'm like, damn, they ain't trying to like get us out of here, get the next one in. And then the rules, like they don't have rules. I put, bro. I ain't seen nothing too crazy. I don't even really be reading the policy. <laughs> no, I seen one girl. She said, you can't have this type of hair tight. You need to have this amount no of hair on your head. Yeah, she got a little. You need to have at least five inches of hair. I'm tired. Hold on. Some people cut their hair up and try to be birdie. It's some your gripping skills. That's what I was going to say. People, some people can grip it. Like, she, she like it. She need to add on a new, uh, <laughs> <laughs> A new service. Skill. Shit. Something. We should have brought a guy too to talk about them barbers. Cause I don't know what goes on in there. I'm sick of that. My hair is shit. No, I heard say tap it. Where that dog go? Right. He did look a little innocent. But I didn't know how he was walking he around. Mad. Like eventually, you know, get into that. Oh, lashes. Uh, I was about to say, I remember you doing her in high school. A little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. The natural style. Right. I would do he it. was on it. The yeah. uh, biceps, the yep. uh, roller, roller wraps. wraps. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking about doing that, though. <laughs> yeah. I, I want my own. That's a good hustle. You think so? Yeah. But a lot of people don't begin their natural hair though. That's true. I feel like it now everybody's on this whole wave. Of, my hair ain't got to be to my ass. See? Your hair ain't that long ago. But how you gonna get it there if it ain't healthy? If you're not taking care of your taking natural care. hair. But we do need more of those type of hairstyles that like dedicated to natural hair. Yeah. Really won't be on that. Like I wanna go to somebody and they can do a nice ass twist out and then like or flat twist it. Why? Because 
That's the only reason why I don't wear my little fro. Like, as soon as I do it myself. Mm -hmm. And then, I don't know what I be doing wrong. It don't be looking like everybody else. The girls be going. <laughs> Yeah, I had did some flat twists in the front one time, and that shit, it was done by like 30 minutes. Okay. And, uh, but I got two different hair types, so of course, is it like, it's all curly. Like, one that said, I don't know, like, you don't know, like, you got that good hair, you need to work out. I was like, but you don't got to deal with it. Right. Like, my hair is like a certain pair of and my hair is like real tight. Oh, like, yeah. like, That's how it is right here in the crown like, part. Right, and then it's like thicker right here. Yeah. So I just be like, you know, like, I feel like in high school we was all rocking the natural. Who? We all was. I was sick of my. I had a soul. I mean, you had it. You had it out sometimes. I was quick to. Get but a you was the first with like you yeah. know sewing in the weeds. I didn't know nothing about. No, no. As soon as I, I as soon as I found shape. out what the heck a sewing was, I was like, oh. Auntie, I want that. <laughs> she used to slay you too, though. Thank as you. it went on, I'm like, okay. <laughs> I started getting crochet and shit, having them braided back. But like, I don't know why I got that. It was all right. I did that for, I did the one curls, the crochet curls. Uh -huh. They look so big on me. Like, I got these little Which head. Which one? Like, I think it was like Oh, it was like her weed? Mm -hmm. And then it was the little curly ones. Oh, uh, yeah. Girl, that looks so big on me. Girl, I had uh, locks. I mean, and we try to put day. baby powder in it to make it look dusty. The, uh, shine go away. <laughs> I'm crying. Girl, but now they say cute, like, versus how we used to get it done. Yeah. Girl. Nah. I see now people wearing crochet, but, like, with the hair, like my mama, mm -hmm. she just now started getting her hair done and really? stuff. Like, I had to turn her on to some people. Because <laughs> all my high school, middle school years, she had the ponytail or, like, a uh, roller wrap. She never had weed. I was going to say, that's one thing I'm going to do. Or nothing. Hey. That's so all I told her. I was like, you need to wear your natural hair, you know? Get weed. I'm over here talking. I need to wear mine. What? Yeah. <laughs> Give me a little break. Right. It's been a minute since I had my natural out. I'm over here waiting on it to cool down now so I can get a silk. Facts. Now I'm getting a silk press. I'm going to get the ends trimmed. Silk press seasoning. I go to this woman in Indiana. Yeah. She was like right here by the beach. Huh? I said, we should be like close to it. Right. But no, as soon as I get off the highway, though, she right there. Oh, that's clutch. Yeah. You ain't definitely. No driving for real. Right. As soon as I go over the bridge. We're talking about her going to Middletown. I can't right. Talk. That's 30 minutes. Yes. But like, I can cut it to like 20, 25. With the driving. <laughs> if, she, if you leave before 5. True, true. <laughs> hey. Now she had me in there one day, and I got stuck in truck. I'm like, ah. Oh. Oh, I ain't coming back. It's late. No, man. Man. no, my last artist will have me come down 6 and 30. I was like, nah, I can't Thank do it. Because that traffic, she lives out, what is that, some Indian trail? That's oh, 5 too. Yeah. That's it's close to my job, man. Watterson or yeah, something? Yeah, it's out. I don't know. It's <laughs> out, right. I just shrunk. I can't do that. I thought about getting into locks, too, though. So I can sure. do like men and women. Sure. Yeah. I'm telling people, just get on your hustle. Like do right. everything. I'm telling people, do That's, it all. Right. And then, but really, I'm thinking about money too, like to invest in it. Mm -hmm. So it's like I want to do it. But it's like I and lock and jail stuff. Like everybody be saying yes. Yeah, like that little, that little tool right there, like thirty five. I'm like, oh no, I get that. That's what they be using. Mm -hmm. oh, I thought they used beeswax. Perfect. They said stop doing that. Why? Because they said it builds up real fast. Mm. I could believe it. I gotta ask my mama when she she be locking up my own thing. She uh, do her own research and stuff. Oh shoot. So she need to get on it too. That's why I be telling me about like she used to do my stuff days. <laughs> I know my mama did my uh, box braids one time. This is like 2015. It was all right. I guess she didn't want to pay the money for me. I feel like. <laughs> you gonna find a way. I feel like. I remember we was in the living room. It took two days. I had on a bonnet. I'm on FaceTime. Bonnet, oh. half braids. <laughs> She's like, we'll finish it tomorrow. Girl. <laughs> Speaking of that, that's because of the prices, though. $200, yeah. $500 for some soft locks. For some soft locks. When I found out how to do them, it ain't nothing but crochet her again wrapped up. Yeah, that's what it is. But I hate the takedown. Of I know. It. I hate that shit. But that's what it is. I have to go to the Oh, I'm just... <laughs> Snip. Girl. And with the plaits, and then you got... That's why I'm some confused fun. on how some people be cutting their hair off. I'm like, why are you cutting so hard? Right. They think their hair done grew. Like, you know. <laughs> No one is shrunk up in there. It's okay. In the rain. Little, it's okay to be a little delulu. It's okay. <laughs> no, nah, when the shit's gone, <laughs> you'll be like, what happened? 
No, I don't like paying extra for lean. Because all, all my times that I did get weed, they was naturally just making it long mm -hmm. for me. Now you got to pay for long. Lean, size, yeah. parts. I'm like, hold on. I used to get the regular. They used to just make it long. Like, you usually know what to do. Right. I almost, like, box rolls, they used to be like $80. Now they're like $200, $150. i am like. Compared to when Not was too, though? I'm like. I remember yeah. when Not was came out. Was that 2019? Because box, after that, box is gone. I don't even know about the Not the box rolls. I want that more. Like, I feel like box rice last longer than Nautilus. Real talk, because it's like, yo, with Nautilus, your real hair color yeah, can range. Yeah, so it's like, But I feel like nowadays, they be trying to make it flat. All that gel? Yeah, all that gel, they want to make the hair, like, the the box flat. I don't know why. I'm like, it's, it's cute, but, like, when it starts yeah. getting fuzzy, right. I'll be ready to <laughs> take this shit out. Like, what can you say about your hairstyle today? And... Not the person who did it, but like oh, the like service. It was cool. Like we was in our eating, talking, yeah, <laughs> watching <shows. laughs> I really like my brother. Like she real cool. Yeah. We be I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I didn't even know. What? Hold the phone. <laughs> Because I wasn't going to give you a shot for the video. I'm like, Girl, you probably don't look, I'm like, look, I'm going to ask you, do you drink? Because I was going to bring a little bottle. Yeah, <laughs> I have some vodka there. What? What the hell? So your mama know too, you see? She know. Man, she don't. I don't be telling her. She be like, Ooh, what you got the money? She's about to go get a little yeah, yeah. like, So she know what you have. Mm -hmm. and I was like, yeah, I went to work. It was like, hey, it was like, they're like, are you high? I said, no. You said it like how you said it. Yeah, I said, no. I am dead. I said, well, I, know. I, said, I said, I said, I know when I get my lashes done, they break. <laughs> no way. Girl. A shot, a drink, and a popsicle. Like, they got the little alcohol. Let me stop. Let me stop. <laughs> Girl, no, you don't sit. Like, we damn near 25 now. It's like, I'm, I'm not. Girl, why was I at the doctor? She drawing my blood. She done seen my birthday. She done said, oh, well, you got three more years till you're 25. Oh, and then after that, you ain't got much to do because I'm going to be 30. She's like, you ain't got nothing left. So. Not too much. Yeah. Not I was like, much. I did not want to hear that. Chill out. <laughs> Chill out. You know, I don't But you're still young. It's okay. I'm like, what you trying to make it so I'm old? That's all yeah. I feel. Like, oh, Tell me I'm pushing 30. My stylist is cool though. That's what we talking about. And um, I did have this other stylist. I ain't been to her in a minute, but I still be calling her. She's good with like business and stuff. Mm -hmm. Or she be supporting or like shout me out and stuff like that. That's how um, I was just my moves. I still go to her for like some stuff, like some trims and stuff. Mm -hmm. She ain't gonna let me do it. Right, right. So yeah, she's cool. We all have our, we all human. So that's why it's okay if y'all like reschedule and stuff. We just wanted to talk about it. You know, like, <laughs> why are you rescheduling what happened? I feel like they be doing that sometimes. Like, like, trying to replace your spot? Mm-hmm. Like, say somebody pay a little extra to, mm -hmm. and they're like, oh, I'll just Money do off. talk, though. No. I don't like it. Mm-mm. I have plans. So. I just know one time I did try to get in, and I didn't, they didn't tell me somebody was already there, though. Of course they don't. Mm -hmm. But I walked in. Well, I didn't even walk in. She later told me because I was texting her and she's not texting back because she's doing the her. I didn't know she was doing her. I'm thinking Damn. I'm the earliest appointment. But no, nah, I'm the second. That's how I be. I be trying to book them 11, 10 o'clock appointments. Yeah. And then come in and somebody's there. I'm like, you're right. Look now. I was trying to just get out of there though. I'm trying to come in and go. Mm -hmm. Get in and get out. Get in and get out. But y'all, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe to this video. <laughs> Let me know how y'all feel about your hairstylist. If you're from a different city or state or even country, does this often happen to you? Have you had a bad experience or a good one? We want to know. And this is Black Bastard TV. We are out. Bye.